gonna be setting up our takedown with our left hook, slipping the feet, arm bar from back control. So using my left hook, I'm gonna get him to raise his hands high as I set up my double leg. Off my left hook, I'm gonna be taking my step, level changing just slightly, shoulder to the pit, head to the outside, now he's blocking his legs, giving me a good bump to get my takedown. Okay, I finished my takedown. He's gonna have feet to my hips to create some, some space between us where I can't just land any big shots. Okay, he's gonna be pushing his hips up, not letting me land these. So what I'm gonna do here is just start by slipping the feet. I'm gonna pass them off as he tries to pull them back in front of me, slipping the feet, throwing one good punch as he rolls to his hands and knees. I'm going to be looking to get my back control. What I'm doing now is just driving my hand, posting my hand to the mat, driving my left arm through, creasing my elbow to his bicep, and sliding my shin to the back of his head. I want to start driving his head under, so I'm going to drop to my side, keep my pressure onto his head as I start to reach for his shin. Okay, once I have a shin, I'm going to be pulling his leg to me, Lifting as I keep driving my shin. Legs up, head under. Now I'm just diving my arm under to control his leg. This is so that he can't sit up. So he tries to sit up, go ahead. I've got his leg and I'm using my leg as an as a anchor here. Keeping an angle, pressure down, squeezing my knee. So try to sit up again. Now I'm just sliding my hips underneath. Left leg over. Pinching my knees, digging my toes to the mat, and controlling thumb up. Now I just hip in and finish that on the 